How to Build an Email List The name of the game is email marketing, and it's a great way to build loyal customers, right? So, you put out an ad on social media platform, and it's getting a good level of engagement. You're happy with it. But how do you convert that momentary interest into lasting loyalty? You get them to a place where they will get more of what they just saw. From promotional offers, to showcasing products and services, or telling them personal stories that will have them hooked to your narrative, there are a lot of things you can do to get consumers to stay with you and, in time, pay for what you're offering. Let's go through the process of building an email list that's easy for you and the consumer. The first step is to have a landing page with a unique or strong domain name. When your consumer clicks on the pop-out ad, they need to go to a place that gives them more of what they just saw. This is one of the most useful ways to build an email list. Oftentimes, when people see that they have to fill out a form, they want to shut that tab and go right back to browsing the Internet. To avoid that, you may want to take advantage of the interest they have shown in the content of the pop-up ad and offer them a goodie. Depending on the service you run, it could be a voucher, an instructional video guide, or a free ebook that is exclusively for those who sign up for the email list. This is referred to as a content upgrade. It's kind of like offering candy to a kid. While that has a morbid kidnappery vibe to it, when it comes to attracting customers, freebies can work wonders. Those who give you their email ID get to unlock the goodies. Creating a smart bar is another way of grabbing your visitors' eyeballs. A smart bar is a bar at the top of the website that doesn't go away, even when the visitor scrolls down. It's kind of like priority notifications on your phone. No matter what else happens, this thing stays on top. Now that you have them on your email list, the next level of engagement begins. You need to send them timely emails to make sure your customers keep coming back to you. You might think you can do it manually, but if you have it all figured out, wouldn't it be nice to have it automated? In the business, those are called autoresponders. Even if you haven't used them before for business purposes, you have certainly seen them in one form or another. Your auto-generated bank emails and out-of-office vacation responders are all part of this facility. Autoresponders are emails that are scheduled to be sent way ahead of time. For example, when an individual signs up for your service, you can automate a welcome email taking them through the many benefits of signing up for your service. Autoresponders will get a lot of work done while you focus on the things that only you can do for your business. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.